Good afternoon my friends, how are you? Hope you guys are doing very well and welcome on this new live trading video from Extreme Trader. This is Salah speaking. Today's live trading video is very special because we are going to trade the signals sent by Angela on the premium group signals group on Telegram. This is the signals as you can see on Telegram. The first signal was for the CAD GPY and I'm going to place the trade right away because the signal is indicating for the buy. Let me just reduce the lot size and here we place the buy order as you can see the cat gpy to be entered with the first target of 35 pips of profit so let me just set the take profit level to be 35 actually i'm going to make it less than that i'm going to make it about 20 like that that is the good thing you can use about the signal you don't have to follow them exactly like you are robots just follow what you are seeing and if you are feeling comfortable about it now let's check the pound the uh, AUD and the signal is for the buy right away and I'm just looking at the level just to be sure that the signal is valid you have to also be sure what you are doing what you are buying as you can see we are on a support level right here and the signal is actually given on the right level because we are seeing that there is a bullish breakout candle at that resistance and I'm going to place the buy order uh, now uh, let me just confirm using the trend lines first and like that I can confirm yes that is actually good level to start buying the pair and I'm gonna place the buy order and let me just see if I wait for the next resistance that's about 28 pips of profit as you can see the tech profit level is 30 pips of profit so I'm gonna set my tech profit level right there on the resistance uh, for almost 28 pips as I said you don't have to be really restrictful about following these signals just um, use your instinct and your analysis your own analysis to confirm if your entry is, is valid now let's check the pound the NZD and it is very similar to the pound the AUD as well we can see that the pair has broken out from the resistance level here and on 30 minute time frame we can see that we are on a support level and which has broken the resistance and right now I have placed the buy order now similar to the pound I'm going to set my take profit level you can see that the pair uh, the signal says 30 pips of profit for the take profit level 1 64 take, uh, take profit 2 and 104 take profit 3 so here I'm feeling more comfortable right here because this is the nearest support as well with almost 24 pips of profit so hopefully it should be good these are the signals sent by Angela today so let's see what will gonna happen when I'm following these signals so let me now just uh, pause this video and I'll be back to you later to show you what will gonna happen with these trades as you can see so far the signal is not going uh, well uh, we had uh, the USDGPY signal being sent one second what is that okay so the USDGPY is given uh, for the sell and I'm going right now for the USDGPY and we can see it is uh, actually a good level to start short I think because we are on a after a breakout candle from that support and this candle seems like it's retesting this level and we are on a resistance here as well so I believe it is all right let me just check on 30 minute time frame uh, we can see that here we have this bearish breakout candle after on the third attempt of the support so this signal seems valid and I think it's gonna keep going down to that support level I'm going to place the sell order right here following the signal as you can see the first target is now 20 pips let me just set my take profit level to be on 20 pips actually I don't have to follow that exactly I will just make it right here 15 pips on the nearest support because I think it's gonna take way too much time until it reach the 20 pips we are seeking 15 pips should be enough uh, all right let me now pause this video again and I'll be back to you later to show you what will gonna happen with these trades one second okay just showing you here uh, I think the recording software is hanging I'm trying to pause the video just give me some time it should pause okay um, we are in minus dollars minus ten dollars so far and 
yeah should be fine now I think let me just confirm again everything is okay these signals have been entered correctly all right so let me now just uh, make sure again pause the video and I'll be back to you All right, as you can see, the pound AUD is going in the profit. It is now uh, breaking out from the resistance. There is a strong momentum on the pound pairs. We can see right now we are on $10 of profit for all the signals. In general, uh, in total, we are in $10 profit. Look at this strong bullish momentum. I mean, look at that. The momentum here is very strong. It's really amazing and it's giving uh, giving us a lot of profits uh, USD GPY also going in the profit is falling down all going so well so far uh, we are still far not, not that far we are about actually to hit the take profit level on the uh, pound AUD the candle is very close I think it's gonna hit it right now yeah the momentum is really strong on the pound the signal was amazing it was valid and very good signal I'm really happy and glad that mem the members in our group have entered the signal and have earned good profit out of it that, that's very nice look at the pound and ZD it's going up it's about to hit the take profit level uh, the first take profit level very close to it very nice and good signals and even the USDGPY is falling down. I mean, that's uh, so far actually very satisfying for me, and I'm a good. I'm good with it. And right now, I'm thinking about entering uh, the tech profit level two. As you know, there are several options we can do. However, I don't have time here to explain all of them. Uh, I'm going to use at least two of them here. Um, as you know, one of them is to close the trade and open another one. The other option is to open a pending order on the take profit level and we can see here the pound and ZD has already hit our take profit level and I'm going to place another trade hoping to reach the take profit too and I will set my take my stop loss to be just 10 pips uh, away from the entry. That is actually not the recommended style I'm just showing to you the options because in this way you are actually paying again for the commission and you are paying more for entering that trade for the spread so it's actually not that recommended in my opinion the best thing you can do let me try if I can show you later uh, let me just uh, do something here I can show you later what is the best option in my opinion which is set the stop loss right below the take profit one and that is let me just uh, I'm what I'm doing right now is setting the pending order so if the candle is gonna hit the take profit level, the take profit one is gonna active or is gonna activate the uh, pending order, and this way it is just similar to the first option, uh, but in this time we are using the uh, pending order instead of opening it manually, and of course I believe most of you pre uh, preferring uh, the pending order. Let me just uh, confirm. Let me let me cancel this one. Let me cancel the tech profit level and just activate the pin, uh, just keep the pending order or you know something. I will delete it. Let me remove the pending order. Yes, that's better. So what I will do right now is I'm going to, to show you the other option which I, which I prefer and we can keep the maximum profits uh, is we can actually make a stop loss line here, drag it down, now bring it up. So that is your stop loss. As you can see right here 14 pips okay so in worst scenarios I'm going to close this trade with um, 14 pip, uh, 14 pips or dollars yeah 14 pips and almost ten dollars of profit that is in worst cases if the candle is gonna keep going up it will take me with it and I will be in more profit if it goes down I'm gonna close the trade with profit that is the most uh, recommended uh, option we we actually prefer in extreme trader signals and let me just pause the video all right so we can see that the trade has hit the tech profit level with 15 pips of profit the candle went down so anyway I am in profit anyway so that, that this this account started with uh, I think 318 or 16 dollars and right now we are in profit of uh, 
I don't know about maybe 23 24 dollars right now it is 341 uh, we can see the other trades USD GPY is still struggling uh, the pound and ZD as you can see the take profit level uh, 2 has been set and the next uh, the other trade is opened anyway I really prefer the other style where we can actually set the stop loss below the uh, take profit one and the candle is gonna uh, be in our favor anyway um, yeah that's good as we can see the pound and the signal is right here and I'm just making sure where we entered we entered right here right here yes exactly so how many pips is that that is about 48 pips as I said you don't have to be very restrictful about these pips uh, mentioned in the signal just follow what is enough good for you and uh, let me just pause the video and come back to you okay so as you can see uh, the pound in ZD is about to hit the take profit too however I think I, it's time to close it I just don't feel comfortable to stay in this thread anymore and I'm going to just close it because I, I cannot really keep recording for a long time this time and let's see now we have the cat GPY which is still struggling and this is in profit however but still I think it might actually go down at this point on the resistance and USD GPY now reversing seems it's might take time take some time before it's reversed and go down let me just look at the left okay now everything seems good the signal seems valid um, the USD GPY I'm expecting it to reverse actually oh shit hold on okay yes I'm expecting for the USD GPY to reverse at this previous support level and it's gonna keep its position as a resistance so anyway let me now pause the video and I'll be back to you later to show you what will gonna happen and Sheila has sent uh, the signal to close the cat GPY and I have to follow what she's uh, sending here in this video so yeah she said to close the cat GPY with 15 pips of loss and I think she's right in this one so let's just close it so 15 pips of loss is fine uh, pound AUD has hit the 16 the take profit level 2 with 60 pips of profit as you can see she sent the announcement to the members who kept the trade running they have earned at least 60 pips only from this trade while cat GPY has 15 pips loss I mean that is more than perfect that is totally fine let me now check the other trade the USD GPY it is still falling down I think it's gonna be good let me now pause the video and I'll be back to you to show you now the USD GPY is going in profit uh, I'm fine with this one I think I'm gonna keep it because I really cannot keep recording for a long time uh, sometimes we just have to stop um, before the, the tech profit level being reached uh, I just need to pause the to, to stop the recording right now and I finish the trade with this profit I mean it was a really good signal we can see that euro AUD signal has been sent as a bonus signal and I did not enter it sadly however uh, it ended in profit we can see Angela has sent the uh, announcement euro AUD has hit the take profit level with 20 pips of profit very good day and I have to tell you we are not expecting every single day to be as good as this one but today was really good and that is an option that is an example of how our signals are being performed in the premium group really well done uh, good job for, uh, from Angela and I'm very satisfied with these signals we can see the pound in ZD has hit the tech profit level 3 with 100 pips of profit amazing right? very nice I mean we have earned approximately 290 pips of profit today against 15 pips of loss so and of course don't forget that you can contact Angela you can find her contact details in the description below this video you can find her link uh, on telegram and you can contact her to join the extreme premium signals we have the full right to be proud and happy and we can promote these signals because it's belonging to us this is our work this is our find I mean really I'm so proud of our uh, job here and I'm very happy with the product we are providing with the clients so in the end uh, I hope that was informative to you and I would like to thank you for watching.